Hey, hello everybody. Um, I want to do some uh, emphasize video on threads and uh, uh, text box. Um, writing very fast to the text box uh, with a scroll down. Okay. I've been using this uh, uh, ability to write to a text box data and scroll to the bottom uh, very often. And lately I have some problems and then I found the better way to use it. So let's view some, some technique and see the solution. Okay, what we want to achieve is the following. We want to write very, very fast. And you see, as you see here, um, the scroll bar jump to the start and to the end, jump start to the end. Okay, in some video, you will see that if um, the delay is one other millisecond, which means it's very slow, then there is no problem. The scroll down will go a little bit jump here and there. Okay, so the solution is to use instead of uh, invoke in a thread with uh, control dot text and do the plus sign and everything. Okay, is to use the append text and not, not use this technique. This will um, cause the scroll bar to work um, very, very fast and scroll to the down. Let's make it uh, maybe one, one millisecond. And you can see here, the scroll down is always at the bottom and it's not jumping to the south. So append text is the right way to append to the end of a to append the end of uh, the text and scroll down using this technique and this is you can find it everywhere but the right way is to use this one another option uh, that you don't want to use is using the control uh, illegal force which means that we can um, um, eliminate the invoker inside thread this is not recommended because it will not work most of the time mostly invisible and enabled so it's not guaranteed to work okay so as you see it's, it's working now but it's not not guaranteed to work by the way as a uh, as a note or hint how do you know that your application has a problem okay if you, um, for example, your application is running and then you minimize it, and then when you press it again, it doesn't doesn't uh, go back. Okay, so you know you have a problem. Okay, so now we don't have a problem because it go back. But if you click on the application, it doesn't go back. Then you know that you have uh, an invoke invoker issue in a thread uh, with a UI. This is a very good indication that you have a problem. Um, one thing that I want to close is the how to abort this thread. So if I do join this, which is the right way to make this thread um, uh, ended, this will stack because it's very, working very fast. Okay. And um, it could stack, yeah. And bookers, let's do like this. See, when I do the invoker, it hang. Okay, so one option is to do a bot okay which is not the recommended way but in this case the problem is that this um, this never ends okay so I need to abort the thread in order to close the application um, let's try to do the invoker with the append text we actually need to do uh, let's make it two 
And instead of this one, I can do textbooks one, and then I can do two string. And this should work, uh, okay. Why doesn't go back? No. Ah, okay, okay. Why we don't have it? Because we already are in invoke. So we can it go here and then now it will work. So we can do both. We can do the this uh, we can do the this invoke and we can do Let's remove. Okay, I did it because we need all this area to do inside the UI, and this in indicate that this code will write inside the message pump of the cow and thread instead of opening a new thread. Um, that's it. So I think the most of the part of the video is uh, focusing on append text instead of do the plus a text and make the car car working with uh, a very fast uh, scroll down okay have a good day and please subscribe to my channel if you like this video